I see many people are uh, still uh, trying to figure out what is the right link. Uh, there is some difficulty for people and we are getting lots of messages. We will wait for two to three minutes for everyone to come in. Okay. And please understand that uh, the intention of the program was uh, not to you know make it like a mass program so we only wanted genuinely interested people to come on the program so give it a minute or two Please drink enough water before we start. Drink lots of water but not too much. You don't want to get up in the middle of the meditation. I think the screen is also very bright. Oh. Four. Yeah, I think uh, this is much better. I thank everyone, especially I thank my master who blessed me and wanted me to do this for all of you. I hope that everyone who wanted to be on the program could get the message and doesn't matter if you cannot join today, this is a five day course. So, you can come in after the second day also, no problem. Um, so, take your asans or a clean cloth which only you will use as your base to sit on as a cushioning seat. But do not take cushions and pillows that you use for sleeping. And do not sit on your bed. Please sit on a chair if you cannot sit cross legged. If you I think uh, I volunteers please uh, go into the profile and uh, direct other people. Many people are sending messages and uh, they are going to the personal profile. Uh, volunteers, please take care of that and uh, direct the people to come to Meditation Foundation fan page. That's where the meditation program is. We have over 3 lakh people who have liked this page and thousands of people who interact with all the posts on this page. And uh, it was the greatness and the humility of uh, Swami Advaitananda who wanted this to happen. And uh, I think uh, 
most people are a little confused about uh, where it is so volunteers please direct uh, and go on the messenger and tell people not to call and not to unnecessarily get misguided those who are joining from whatsapp uh, i think uh, they know that it is uh, on the fan page and those who are coming late do not worry this video still remains on your facebook page here itself so you can tune into this meditation any time okay i will not delete the post so don't be worried and do not think that if you join in late or if you miss the live session then it's not as effective it's not like that so we should not waste more time because we are already running short of time there are lots of people who are uh, doctors you know people in the medical field who have taken some break for themselves they have joined us through zoom and whatsapp telegram and some other google apps also to come live so i really appreciate that you all took out time for yourself actually and uh, it's important that you know you use this break for yourself as much as uh, best possible do not think about work for some time and please keep your mobiles on silent be seated on your asan be seated comfortably relax your body close your eyes spinal cord straight keep breathing normally give yourself the time to relax do not be in a hurry to meditate relax your shoulders if you feel you are breathing short just breathe normally try to breathe slowly and deeply inside the stomach relax your body keep your palms like this open on the lap resting on the lap and do not chant any mantras or do not do any mudras of the fingers just keep them open okay facing the sky but completely relaxed relax your shoulders relax your knees relax the entire back keep breathing normally shri guru bhyo namaha hari o keep your eyes closed
Find of God's dream. Drop the entire body weight onto the earth. Let go of all your efforts. Let us all do three long recitations of Om Bij Mantra I will do it four times so you can hear it the first time and follow suit Relax more Deep breath in. And breathe out. Take a deeper breath in. normally Watch your thoughts. Do not fight your thoughts. Do not question. 
or resist the mind. Be a witness. And choose to not focus on any thoughts and any imagination. Bring your attention to your nostrils, to the point, to the tip of the nose, between your nostrils. Keep your attention to this point. Keep breathing normally. Observe the sensations and the flow of the energy. Keep your attention fixed to this point. Another slow and deep breath in and breathe out slowly. Bring your attention to your third eye. This is the spot in between both your eyebrows. Slightly above the eyebrow range, not too below, but slightly above the eyebrow range. Exactly in between the eyebrows. Bring your focus over there. Do not imagine the forehead. Instead, Internally, bring your attention. Internally, look at this third eye. There is no actual eye. It is just this metaphysical aspect of energy.
with the blessings of Mahakali and Sadashiva. I will now initiate the activation of your third eye so that the energy starts flowing across and the third eye chakra blossoms and starts spinning in the right manner. Keep your attention fixed on the third eye. Spinal cord still straight. Shoulders relaxed. Observe the light and the energy. No matter what, do not open your eyes. Do not move your body. The intention is very clear. Whatever negative thoughts, stress, anxiety, any negative imaginations, any attachments that put you down, to be released away. Allow the universal divine energy, allow the blessings of the divine to flow into your system. Through this opening of the third eye, Keep breathing normally. Let the attention still be on the third eye. Keep breathing normally. I am with you all and I love you all.
You are all doing great. It's important to focus only on your third eye at this moment. For your own sake. For your own soul. For your own happiness. Keep breathing normally. No matter what happens, focus only on the third eye. Let gratitude prevail every moment. Keep breathing normally. Bring your attention back to the tip of the nose, in between the nostrils. Bring your attention back to the tip of the nose. Relax. Keep your eyes closed. Keep your attention at the tip of the nose in between the nostrils.
Keep breathing normally. Relax your whole body. Relax Let go of all the efforts. Relax completely. If you want to stretch your joints, stretch your feet, please do so. become very comfortable. Relax more. With gratitude to the divine. the sense of being grateful to the universe, to Sadashiva, to our great masters, to Mahakali, to your own gurus. To our Kuda Devis and Kuda Devas for this opportunity to initiate the awakening of the third eye. They have supported us and blessed us. Our life will never be the same again.
bring your attention to the surroundings, to your own body. Today you have all taken one more step towards your spiritual growth, towards the divine and You have chosen to open a pathway to communicate to your God, your master or your mentor, to the Divine Supreme. through this channel. Your soul has expanded the subconscious is now more in attunement with the divine would like to close today's session. Whenever you feel comfortable, you may open your eyes very gradually. Do not be in a hurry. Now that your third eye has been initiated, towards the divine connection, I'm sure by the end of the five days, we will all be much more closer to the Divine who lives inside us and we will all experience beautiful and amazing miracles and also fulfillment of our desires as we practice this every day. You can practice this after the five days, after you finish five sessions. And for those who are vegetarians, the experience is likely to be deeper. For those who are of onion garlic, it will still be deeper. Those who are into substance abuse, or into any intoxications apart from meditation, or yoga, because meditations and yoga are, I think, one of the highest levels of, you know, intoxications. So, anyone into alcohol or 
smoking or any sort of drugs or psychedelic drugs, psychotropic drugs. May not have as deep an experience. But with the daily practice of the third eye chakra meditation, it is possible to de-addict yourself and also I would say that be careful what you think and what you attract. Henceforth, whatever you imagine and whatever you think about, the chances of that being manifested are manifold. So be careful, okay? Whatever you imagine and whatever you attract, be very careful about that. Eat a lighter meal for tomorrow's meditation session and try to finish your dinner before 8 p.m. itself. Latest 8 p.m. If you can have it before 7.30 p.m., it's much better. So, with lots of love and blessings, with the blessings of my master, Shirdi Sai Baba, and all the other holy masters who wanted me to help you all, and who helped me to reach you all, I bow down to them all. Om Namah Shivaya, lots of love and blessings.